Good morning, Sean. Jurors heard explicit testimony Monday in the trial of a Franklin man accused of trying to sell a 14-year-old girl to a 26-year-old man for sex. William Shrine is charged with child sex trafficking and endangering the welfare of a child. In opening statements, prosecutors showed photos of the girl. They said Shrine and his wife were shopping to prospective buyers. The jury heard from the prosecution's star witness, Anthony O'Hickey, who said he offered 5000 to Shrine in an effort to protect the girl. Prosecutors said O'Hickey was wearing a wire for police, and he recorded the negotiation. O'Hickey said he, his father, his father sexually abused him as a child. News 9 does not usually identify the victims of sexual abuse or assault, but he gave permission to be identified as a victim for this story. Prosecutors asked O'Hickey what he thought of his father. O'Hickey told the jury that when his father bragged about buying a fresh teenager, he had to do something. He went to Northfield Police and agreed to wire, wear a wire. He told jurors he met Shrine in November to talk about a part of his truck, but the conversation quickly turned to the teenager. O'Hickey testified that there was another man in his 40s at the meeting and seemed interested in the girl. O'Hickey was an emotional witness and cried several times while telling the jury that he offered to buy the girl to save her from abuse, but he pretended he wanted her for sex. That night, O'Hickey testified he took the girl out for dinner. He said it was an effort to get away, get her away from the other men. The defense object frequently during the testimony. In opening statements, defense lawyers asked the jury to keep an open mind about a man and wife who were desperately poor. The testimony is expected to continue for the next three days. Reporting live here outside the Merrimack County Courthouse in Concord, New Hampshire, I'm Ray Lee King for WMUR News 9. Sean, back over to you.